we are free to do what was impossible before. We are free to live unselfishly. But what do we do when we use the freedom of the gospel? I probably should be saying, what have we been doing when we have been misusing the freedom of the gospel? Because that's certainly a, a lot of it's going on. Amen. You know, the freedom of the gospel was not intended that we be set at liberty to condemn folk. Amen. Don't hurt. Find ways to lift up. You know, a whole lot of times the church has been turned off in the community where we live and work because we have abused someone's rights with our freedom. Amen. Telling people they're going to hell. That's not in your keeping. Amen. You don't know anything at all about that. Amen. That's left up to God. Amen. You just need to preach the truth Amen. in love. Yes. You need to exercise a loving attitude when you're going in and about the people of the world. Amen. A lot of times we come out with our fists balled up to start with and that will result in nothing but a fight. Yes, sir. Amen. If we are going to exercise the freedom of the gospel, we're going to have to find ways to lift people up. Right. Jesus said, truly and I, if I be lifted up, I will draw all men unto me. We're misusing the freedom of the gospel when we condemn our own brethren and our own sisters in Christ. We are workers together. And if we were really doing what we were designed to do in the first place, we wouldn't have time for such practices. All right. Amen. We're misusing the freedom of the gospel when we meddle in the autonomy of other congregations. Right. We're misusing the freedom of the gospel Amen. when we interfere in the way folk worship. Oh, y'all look at me like y'all in the way. You know what I'm talking about. We got folk that are... Uh, advocating one thing and folk that are advocating another thing. Yes, sir. Can you, can, can you say amen? amen. <laughs> can you praise God in worship? Yes, sir. Well, you can find out real quick. I'm not a disciple of Charles Murray, but of Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. <laughs> amen. amen. The Bible says in Acts 2, 47, praising God oh, and having amen. favor with all of the people amen. and the Lord added to the church day. Such as should be such. Yes, you know, one time a brother and I were visiting and uh, a young man came in and he wasn't a member of the Lord's body. Mm -hmm. And he said, oh, when are they going to sing the doxology? Oh my God. He said, oh, we don't do that in the church of Christ. We <laughs> sure don't. <laughs> we sure Talk don't. To us. Talk to us, Dave. Well, what's the problem? We have a problem with the word doxology. It just means an outburst of praise. Paul had a doxology. Peter had a doxology. And you ought to have an outburst of praise. If Jesus is in you, all right, man. Freedom without abusing one's rights. You know, we have, you know, Brother in the church, forgive my expression. Y'all don't get mad. Right. We, got, we got preachers right. who like the peacock. All right. <laughs> they like the peacock. You know how peacock is. He spreads his beautiful tail and he struts all around everywhere <laughs> until he looked down at his feet. <laughs> and then the tail feathers begin to fall. <laughs> yes, sir. Hey. And we got brethren who change the order of the worship service yes. so they can have more time to peacock. Hey, I know somebody not going to like me for what I'm saying. Hey, hey. But I need to put pressure on folk yes, who are abusing yeah. their freedom in Christ. Hey, man. Yes, sir. Who ever heard of a preacher singing for 30 minutes before he began his sermon? Mercy, Lord. Mm. Mercy. Well, now. And then invite two brethren up the background for him. Mm and sang for 15, 20 more minutes, and then preached for an hour and a half. <laughs> well, he's peacocking. He's peacocking. I know so, some of us don't like that, but I just got to tell you the truth, brother. I'm getting too old to stay quiet. That's right. We abuse.
abuse the freedom of the gospel uh -huh. when we practice dishonesty in the church. Yes. Yes. Now, yes. Larry, that's going to cause me some problems. Amen. Yes. But at the same time, we've been practicing dishonesty in the church for a long time. Yes. And then, then we bring these peacock and brethren in showing off. Yes. What a message we are sending the world, yes. man. Some brethren don't care. They don't care about the structure of the church. Just as long as they get their money. Just as long as they get paid. Yes. That's right. Well, hey, that was thank. Well, I know y'all want me to get specific now when I say we practice dishonesty in the church. We tell folk that we don't have choirs in the Church of Christ. We have singing groups. That's the same thing. Come on. Same thing. Look at the dictionary. Same thing. We tell folk we don't have ushers. We have greeters. Same thing. Same thing. You ain't fooling nobody. You're just abusing your rights. You may as well just tell the truth. Tell folk like it is. Amen. Or else they're going to go up to those folk in the Church of Christ and lie too much, and they are partly right. Yes. Amen. Some time ago, we accused the denominational churches of designing services to entertain. Yes. And we in many places have bought that concept. Who lying and sinker? Amen. 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 Home worship service is designed to entertain folks. My brother was talking this morning. You, you want to bring in crowds. You want to break the walls down. Yes, sir. But you don't want to teach anybody anything. Amen. That's it. That's right. Amen. I don't know about here, but I know in St. Petersburg, all you have to do is say, name off half a dozen singing groups and you won't find standing room. Yeah. Amen. That's right. Amen. 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 And they want the preacher to preach a, a sermonette. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The reason why, because all you've got there is Christianettes. Yes, you like to smoke cigarettes, yes, and you would rather listen to the quartet. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We have been made free yes, sir. to serve others by showing love and teaching the truth. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The gospel frees us from sin, but imprisons us to righteousness. Yes, yes, Remember the Apostle Paul in Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 1, I therefore, the prisoner of the Lord, beseech you that you walk worthy of the vocation wherewith you are called, with all lowliness and meekness and long suffering, forbearing one another in love. Endeavoring to keep the unity of the Spirit yes. in the bounds of peace. Yes, sir. Peace, peace. Peace, peace. We are free only to render service yes. by the gospel. Right. We are free only to render service. Right. Amen. Everything in the universe performs a service to some other object. Yeah. Well, the mineral serves.